In my opinion, this unit is Big Cat Friendly. I did have to adjust the straps in the back. Uh, I feel like you probably could be able to make it work if you have a really small head, but I do feel like it is definitely more uh, medium to large head friendly than not. I do wear an average cap size, so girl, do with that what you want to do with that. <laughs> do with that what you want to do with that, but in my opinion, it is uh, big head friendly. And yeah, that is pretty much it as far as the details and specs. If you are interested in my pros and cons, as well as a full 360, then please continue to watch. Okay, so you know I like to start with the cons because I like to end on a high note. Honestly, I really uh, struggle with finding a uh, con with this wig. Like, to me, it is all pros. So, I have to just throw something out there, and I'm going to say that um, maybe I wish it was a little more full, I, I guess. Like, to me, it's full enough. It is definitely giving 150% density, but if I had to just pick a con, that's the only con that I can think of. But the density is what they said that the density is. But I, I just I always feel like I need to give y'all a con because to me, no wig is perfect. And especially when we are leaning more sort, uh, sort of on the affordable side, like Nadula. Nadula is more of an affordable wig company. I feel like there has to be some sort of con. But honey, it's a struggle. Because I don't even consider that a real con. Like, not with this wig because it is what they said it is. But that's the con I'm going to give y'all, okay? That's what I'm throwing out there. Now, my pros with this wig is I love, 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 love the fact that I can wear glueless. This HD lace is HD lacing, honey. Okay? It is very, very rare that I can wear any wig completely glueless and it not be noticeable. And honestly, y'all, I don't feel like it's noticeable. Y'all can tell me what y'all think, but that is a pro. I also love the texture. I also love the length. Like... Those are my pros with this wig. Yes, I would definitely recommend this wig. I feel like it is the ultimate beginner friendly, the ultimate lazy girl friendly wig. Like there's not a whole lot you have to do to this wig. Like you can apply the mousse if you want to. You can uh, spray it with water if you want to. You can bleach the knots if you want to, but I don't feel like any of that is required. I feel like this wig will still be bomb without all of those things. So I would definitely recommend this unit, especially if you are a beginner. All right, y'all, let me give you guys this full 360 so we can wrap this thing all the way up. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. So yeah, y'all, let me know what you guys think about this unit down below. I am interested in your thoughts and opinions. If you are interested in this unit, I will have a direct link to it down below in the description box for your convenience. Once again, shout out to you, Nadula, for sponsoring this video. I truly appreciate it. And once again, thank you for your patience. And yeah, y'all, <laughs> that's all. That's all. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions or you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, girl, click that subscribe button. It's not going to cost you not one red cent. And if you're not already following me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and TikTok. I'm Hilton Missy on Snapchat, and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love folks, next time. Bye. The looks your love completely got every style, and we.